Adamton is a hotel of two sides, the stately home and the budget. A lovely drive from the main gates to the hotel itself. It looks quite grand, doesn't it? From the outside. from the grand hall down to the gardens as you can see someone enjoying their morning tennis courts you can hear the planes at Prestwick though but you're literally in the middle of of the airport They host events and wedding parties. This area of the hotel looks great. It has an atmosphere of being a stately home. Just pausing the video here, this man was fantastic. Great customer service. He made our stay really enjoyable. I love the Art Deco. So this is a basic room, as you can see we'll start off with the bathroom, it's not wonderful, but there's hot water, it's clean enough, we've got a wardrobe, a chest of drawers, a telly that works, a nice bed, oh, excuse me. Yeah, this is a real swell place you got here. Thanks, buddy. Uh, you're welcome. Yeah. A nice bed. Okay, there's a crack there, but it's basic, it's clean. 
it means that you can rest, especially if you're driving like me, um, and just have a good night's sleep. Good night, Squidward. Good night, SpongeBob. The next morning. Horses! Hello, gorgeous. You come to say hello? Oh, no. You don't want me to? No? Oh, okay. You alright? Are you okay? Oh, yeah? You okay? Hello? You are gorgeous. Oh, okay. Why are you touching the barbed wire? I didn't mean to. He is, he was scratching himself, but he's going to hurt himself. Listen to the chomping sounds. They're lovely. And this is right next to the, the field, next to the hotel. So this is the budget side of the hotel. And that's the grand stately side over there. But it's decent, clean. Many of the Britannia hotels are not well liked because of them being quite poor in terms of standards. However, we must remember that they are taking on dilapidated buildings such as this and the one in Liverpool that I didn't stay in. Um, and they are the refurbishing, which costs a lot of money. Otherwise, these beautiful buildings would be lost forever. So Prestwick is four miles away. There are no facilities near the hotel, which is great because it's just, it means that you only get a certain type of clientele. We head into Prestwick and we end up in a Weatherspoons pub for breakfast. I actually had to move seats, it's so busy. So we had to wait for a corner seat to be empty because um, we were sat up on the high one and that wasn't comfortable at all. But Sunday, so it's breakfast Sunday where the school is going to be busy. I like their breakfast menu. If you've enjoyed my videos, please hit the like button, subscribe and the bell so you can be notified. In Jolly Geniuses world, we make the most of our opportunities.